What? Expecting someone else? Aren't you two supposed to be somewhere else? Hey, Joe. It's, it's time, time for green! All right! Good evening. This is the voice of the Irish, Tanner Struckman. And I'm excited to go green virtually here in 2020. Have a great green, everyone. Hi, I'm Bob Albury, owner of Day's Place Pizza and Wings in North Platte. And at Day's Place, we're supporting green. Go Irish, go green! At Nebraska Land National Bank, we support green. <laughs> hey, you guys going to green? I'm going to green. I'm going to green. I'm going to green. We're, we're all, all going, going to green. green. Hello, everyone. We are FNBO. And we support the North Black Catholic Schools and green. green. Go Irish. We're, we're the Cubbies, and we're going, going to green. green. We're gonna go to green. We love green. Go green! Woo! I love it. That's, a, great. that's That's the way to start. But time out. I'm having a uh, flashback. Flashback. It's like we're on TV. Yeah. One time. Mic. One time only again. I know. I feel like I need to say, "Hey, Joe, we're in weather. <laughs> Get your buns out here for sports." Will we remember how to do this? I hope so. Uh, is it like riding a bike? It better be. I've got my hair fluffed. We're okay. ready to go. All right. Are you ready? Let's, Let's do, do this. It. Welcome to Green, everybody. 2020. We may not all be together. In fact, we may be uh, watching from North Platte. We may be watching from Lincoln or Omaha. We may be watching anywhere around the country. But we are so glad you are with us wherever you are at for the first time. It is a virtual green. I am Joe Swift coming to you live from the St. Pat's High School Library. All right, welcome Joe, and I'm Wendy Dotson, Endowment Director. We are so excited to get this event started. We're happy you're here, and we hope to make this a great night for the North Platte Catholic Schools. Now, before we start, let's do a couple of housekeeping items to get rolling. The most important, all right, here's the question. First question of the night, are you registered and bidding? Because that's, that's right. why we're here. We want you to be watching us on uh, one screen and bidding from your phone right. on the green mobile site. If you aren't registered to bid, we want you to do that and do it right now. That's it, and it's easy. All you need to do, get your phone out. If you're not already on our site, all you need to do is text the word GREEN20 to 243725. That's GREEN20 in the message part, and then you're sending it to 243725. So that gets you into our online bidding site so you can place your bids, participate. And once you're on that site, be sure to check um, all of the auction items, our teacher wish list, get ready to donate and all of that on our green mobile site. And we also have some instructions up for you. If you have any technical difficulties tonight, those are the numbers that you want to call. And we also want to remind you that we hope you're placing all your silent auction bids right now. The silent auction will close at 8 p.m. That's 8 p.m. tonight, regardless of when we're done here. So be sure you're watching your phone for your updates and bidding often. And if you are watching us live, and I'm looking right now, a lot of you are, thank you. Thanks for being with us. And tell all your friends, be sure and share this event on your own Facebook. Give us a comment. Tell us, uh, tell us how we're doing. Tell us if I need some powder. I don't know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Call your neighbors. Make sure they are watching. We want to make this the biggest green Absolutely. event ever. We do. And as with all good things, we want to begin our evening with a special prayer and blessing. So let's welcome Father Josh Brown, pastor of St. Patrick's Parish. Welcome, Father Josh. Good evening. Thank you. It's so amazing to be here and to, to pray for this wonderful event. I know I'm confident that God has great blessings in store uh, for our schools and for this green event this year. So let us pray and invoke God's blessing upon everything that we do. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Heavenly Father, we're so grateful. We're so grateful that even in the midst of a pandemic, you have blessed us abundantly. You have given us so much. So much to be grateful for, so much to be thankful for, so much to come here to celebrate. Um, even though we're not together, we know that in each and every place we are, we are being blessed, that we are celebrating your goodness to us and to our schools. I ask you to bless this night. Bless all of our families, bless all of our benefactors. 
bless everyone who just wants this to be a success who wants our schools to continue to succeed because they see the good work that we're doing here for you that we're bringing the students closer to you closer to jesus christ closer in their faith so we just ask you to bless all that we do tonight ask all that are involved bless all the technologies and everything so that this will go smoothly and that it truly will be an excess a first ever green virtual event that we know and are thankful and grateful that it is you who has made this possible so we ask you to bless all that we do bless our evening and bless all of our donors and benefactors open their hearts and their pocketbooks help them to see that this is the most important thing that they will do tonight and the most important thing that they do tonight will affect the future of our students the future of our schools and the future that is your future where you will continue to bless us so we ask you to bless us now and always may almighty god bless you wherever you are in the name of the father the son and the holy spirit amen god bless you thank you very much father thank you Josh. father you're welcome great to see you and thank you for all that you do along with uh, father sager at holy spirit father mark seeker from saint elizabeth ann seton deacon michael davis and deacon matt irish our school is very blessed to have you and all of them offer your guidance and support that's right and i would say also Thank you to our administration for your guidance and support. And speaking of support and guidance, as we look back on 18 years of green, it is truly amazing to think about the vision, the volunteers, all that has gone into it to make this event happen and to make it a success. So join me as we take a little trip down memory lane to celebrate 18 years of green. This was an opportunity to create engagement, to get more people to come together to celebrate the culture of the school and all the things that the school does well. In a fun environment, it's a lot more fun to contribute when you're having fun. And so this was, we, we saw it as a, as a different way to raise money, but more or less create engagement. Our main goal was to make sure that the school kept running for as long as we are alive and in, in town you know that's what our main goal was we wanted to make sure that the school was always going to be around we did not want this just to be a, a catholic school only event we wanted it to be a community-wide event and uh, i think people in town appreciate our school system i think they appreciate the fact that we exist i think i thought it was going to be around for a long time we have our school has been around a long time and it's because people stand behind it and stand with it and just keep going with things and are constantly thinking outside of the box. What can we do to make things better? What can we do for our kids? What can we do for our teachers especially? They work really hard and I think our parents really get that and they understand that we need to do things for them to keep them here because we need them and they're good. Everybody's there for the right reasons, and everybody's, it's fun. It's been a fun fundraiser, I think, all these years. It's really met that over the years. Look how many more people have become engaged, have helped with it, have worked on it, and the more engagement you have, uh, what's the old saying? Uh, once you have the hearts and minds, their wallets will follow, and I think that's been a perfect example here. So we're glad to have been a part of the start. I think it was really fun, especially that first year. You know, we didn't know what would come in for prizes or what people would be, you know, interested in donating. And so we just sent out a kind of a mailing and different things came back as to, you know, gifts people wanted to donate to be auctioned off. And it was kind of fun. It was like opening up this little Christmas, Christmas you know. Oh gosh, look at so-and-so wants to, to donate a trip or so-and-so is donating a piece of furniture. And it, it just kind of came alive. It was fun. It's fun. Uh, that's another easy sell. It's all been fun. Everything is different. And I just enjoy the the time spent with, you, you bring together your tables of the people you hang out with, but then you see all these other tables of people that you, you might not see on a regular basis at, at events, and it's just really fun to mingle with all kinds of different people, former teachers, former students, you know, maybe some classmates and things like that. I enjoy that. They've all been good, 
you know, just well, a nice same. night for everybody to come out. That kind of reinforced how important this was to lots of people. It wasn't just a few, there's a lot of people. I'm hopeful that people will be excited about it and know that they can do it safely and still be a, a really va or vital part of what we try to do here, which is to provide a quality Catholic education to uh, the kids who come here for our families. We both went to St. Pat's and McDade Elementary and then we graduated and then we, when we moved back home we sent all three of our kids to St. Pat's and McDade and now our daughter Kelsey's teaching at McDade and she's sending her kids to St. Pat's so it's just that trickle down effect that I think helps with that and the, and the family oriented part of it is what's really really cool for us to see. We're part of something it's been kind of an institution um, just like Nebraska football or other professional sports teams you might be involved with we're still very much involved with the school and, and how it goes and we're proud of it and it's and it's done well and uh, I think it's it's prepared our kids well they've all gone on and and, and two of the three have postgraduate degrees and the other one is planning to have to go back and get his MBA and so they've learned how to study they've learned discipline and they've learned to share and that that's real important and it would be a shame uh, to ever lose this. Try to help out as much as you can and just maybe dig a little bit deeper and get us through this year and get uh, get us rolling on a good track for next year. The school has been uh, extremely important to us to keep us engaged in the community, to keep us engaged in the faith and that we share this. Oh, so much gratitude for those three couples and for all of the volunteers who have given time and talent to the Green Committee over the years. And there's a lot of them. We have created something really special here and we're just thrilled to keep it going. Absolutely. Let's keep the gratitude rolling by thanking some of our event sponsors. Please make sure you check out all of the information okay. on the Green website, including our sponsor, donor right. and volunteer lists. We don't have time to mention them all, but we are certainly grateful to all of them. Absolutely. Special thanks to Nebraska Land National Bank for underwriting our auction technology and mobile bidding software, to Great Western Bank and Big Red Liquors for sponsoring our spirit wagons, to Sand Hill State Bank and to FNBO of North Platte for sponsoring video production services. Let's also thank our Party Box sponsors. We had Big Red Liquors, The Cedar Room, Dave's Place, Double Dips Ice Creamery, The Flower Market, Pals Brewery, and The Pop Corner. Now I tell you, these boxes were so much fun to put together and we had some really great partners who made it happen. And hey, all of you who purchased a Party Box, are you out there? We hope that you're enjoying it right now. We are also grateful for our Lucky Lotto sponsors. Everyone who purchased a ticket, either online or through the mail, is included in the drawing tonight. Special thanks to our prize sponsors. Uh, they are Pat and Kathleen Keenan, You Save Pharmacy, and Adams Bank and Trust. Okay, Joe, now's when it gets exciting. I am super excited to announce we had a great response to lotto sales. 211 wow. tickets, 211 ping pong balls in our tumbler. So Fantastic. thank you to all of you. I'm excited to see who's going to be our winner. And we want to remind you, everyone who purchased a Lucky Lotto ticket, all of those proceeds support green and they support our schools. So awesome thing to do. And thank you for purchasing those tickets. But it makes me think, Joe, have you ever thought about what it would be like to win the big bucks? Absolutely.
Welcome back to the bonus round of America's favorite game show, Press Your Irish Luck. Let's meet today's contestant, Joe Swift. Welcome, Joe. Joe, Wendy. are you ready to press your Irish luck? Let's do this. No whammies, no whammies, no whammies, no whammies. Stop. <laughs> I didn't, that was great. I didn't hit it big, but two winners will tonight. It is time to draw our lucky lotto winners. Would you say 211? 211. 211 in the hopper. We're going to give them a spin, and two people are walking away with five grand okay. each. So let's, uh, sh we Should ready? We get a drum roll? Oh, yeah, let's, uh, we've got, uh, uh, give us a drum roll. All right. That's the way to do it. Give All right. Spin. spin it really good. This is exciting. And oh my goodness. I'm not looking. One. I'm not looking. Uh, what does it say? Uh, you hold that. 62. Okay. Or is it 29? The suspense 62. Builds. The suspense builds number 62 is Dr. David Cantrell of Kearney, Nebraska. Congratulations, David. Very nice. You are our first winner. That's, that's one big winner, okay. but the good news is, if, hey, if you didn't win, don't worry, because we're going to draw another one. Here we go. We're okay. going to spin it. I'm really going to find a good one in here. I'm looking for just the right one. Let's you see. You have a 1 in 210 chance. Okay. What is that? 193. 193. Ooh, I bet that one was purchased today. I bet it was. Number 193. Let's see if you can guess. Okay, I'm going to give you some clues. <laughs> she is a teacher at St. Pat's. She has three girls that go to school at St. Pat's. And she teaches math. <laughs> Congratulations, Tony Guthrie. You are our other lucky lotto Very winner. Very nice. Congratulations. <laughs> awesome. Maybe, uh, uh, maybe uh, was it the doctor and Carney? Yeah. And the teacher, maybe they're watching tonight. I hope they and are. They can get to bidding on I stuff hope so. because I we've, hope got a, so. we've got a uh, live auction coming up. Congratulations to uh, our winners. Prizes. Oh, by the way. You can yep. claim your prize at the endowment office, 601 South Tabor, yep. anytime Tuesday through Friday That's of right. next week. No school Monday, right? No school Monday. Teachers have meetings, which uh, Mrs. Guthrie may want hers on Monday. But uh, any auction items, prizes, any of that, Tuesday through Friday this coming week. Okay. What do you think? Should we? I think, I think it's time for an sell auction. Sell some live auction items? Absolutely. Okay. First item of business, get your phones out main menu click the category that says live auction we have some awesome items in here and we are excited to get the bids going so now is the time to be placing those bids we'll tell you how this is going to work when our auctioneer calls gives the final call on the item you have two minutes left two minutes left to get and, your bids and, in and i was nervous i was thinking uh are we gonna have to do a live auction i don't know I how to do it oh, oh, oh. nope we brought in we brought in our main man mr rod right 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 Rod, thanks Thank for being you. here. Welcome, Rod. Yep. It wouldn't be the Fun same to without be here you. here again. It's a great time. Let's make some big, big money. Let's Absolutely. do it. Absolutely. Normally we have several items, but this time we're just doing five on five. the live auction. Yeah. So the first item is item number 990. And then let me see where the bidding is at on that right now. I will check that. $4,000, Joe. 4000 is 4, where we're at. All right. It's a right North there. Dakota ice fishing trip. <clears throat> it's at 4000 Rod? Let's get it up there even further. All right, what are you gonna do? Four thousand is the bid. Now we got two feathers in at four thousand dollars. Who get forty one hundred? Four thousand dollar now, forty one hundred, one hundred dollar, one hundred, forty one hundred, four thousand dollar now, one give me one now, one now, one now, forty one, forty one hundred, one hundred, one hundred, forty one hundred, four thousand dollar bid me now, one get one now, one now, one now, forty one. You guys wanna tell just a little bit more about that? Yeah, I do. It's a little bit more about that. Yeah, I do. It's a little bit more about that. Yeah, I do. It's a little bit more about that. Yeah, I do. It's a little bit more about that. Yeah, I do. It's a little bit more about that. Yeah, I do. It's a little bit more about that. Yeah, I do. Because legendary fishing stories start on this trip. Enjoy a two-day, three-night stay at the Woodland Resort in Devil's Lake in North Dakota. It is for seven people. A fish house is offered. They're heated, very comfortable, so it's going to be freezing, but you're going to be in the warm. <laughs> it's donated by Contractor Services, Inc., Rocky mm -hmm. Torres. What, what a trip. There you go. And thank you to Rocky. Hey, now, what are you going to do? $4,100. Four is the bid. 
4,000 dollar baby now, one give me now, 100 dollar, 100 dollar, 41, 41, 41,000, 4,100, 4,100, 4,000 dollar baby now, one give me now, one, one, 4,100, 41, 41, baby now, 4,100, 4,100. I tell you what we're going to do now, you got two minutes to get them in. Okay. Two minutes to get your bids in, and that makes it what, Joe? What time will that be? That will be 724 when this item will close. 724. Okay. 724 the item so will close. if you want to bid on this, uh, you have two minutes. Okay, get those bids in. We are going to move on to item 991. This is a guided hunt. Take it away, Rod. All right, we have 2300 on this guided hunt. 2300 bid. All right, now who get four? 23, 100, 400, 400, 500, 600, 25, 20, 600, 600 now, 600, 500, 600, 25, 20, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, 600, Rod, let's remember this is not only a hunt. You get to hunt at Feather River Vineyard, and when you're done, you get a steak dinner, and I'm pretty sure that comes with some wine. Nice. That sounds like a great time to me. All right, what are you going to do? 25, 2,600. 2,500 is a bid. Who'll get 2,600? 2,500, 600 now. 600 dollars, 600 dollars. 600, 600 now. 600 dollars. 25 one time now. 600, going to go. Did you say 600? 25, 2,600. And I, you have two minutes left to get your bid in. All Two right. Minutes, that will be what time? 723. You have till 723 to get your bids in. Oh, 725. It's 723 right now. I apologize. 725. 725. 2500 bid. Is that right, guys? 2600 bid. 2600? 2700. 2500 right. bid. Who'll give 2600 quick? You got two minutes to get your bids in, guys. Item number 992 Steak with the Shoals. It is, well, it's priceless, really. Nebraska's best beef, Nebraska's best company. You're invited to a steak dinner at the gorgeous home of Steve and Tricia Schultz. All right, looky there, 22 and a half bid. 2,250 now. 2,200, who get 2,300 for it? 2,300 dollar. 2,300, 300 now. 2,300 dollar, 300 dollar, 300 dollar. 23, 2,300, what do you think, Travis? 2,300 dollar, 2,200 now. 23, give me now. 3, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9, Now 4, 2,400, you're out. 2,300 bid, I got Travis Covey in. 23, 24, I'm at 2,300, bid me now. Brad, I was gonna tell you that. It's four, six to eight people, you get drinks. You get great company and either mouth-watering ribeye or fillets donated by Steve and Tricia Schultz. I mean, an awesome dinner, right. right? Wow, oh, yeah. wonderful. Who give 2,400? 23, but I'm now 400. 2,300, now 3's here, now 4. I'm at 23, but I'm now 400, 400, 400, 400, now 24. 23, 24, $300, now 4. All right, you got two minutes to get it in. 727 bid. That item will close at 727. Okay. All oh, right. I, I took you, Travis. <laughs> All right, we're going to move on. Item 993. This is a once in a lifetime experience an African safari planes game hunt. Item 993. Okay, I talked to Rusty a little bit ago, and he said that the hunts have been real slow here lately. That the animals have gotten bigger, and he said by this next year, he said it, it'll really be good. So don't be afraid to jump in, you guys. This COVID thing isn't going to last forever, and let's get in there. We have a starting bid of $2,000. Is that right? $2,000, okay? And we're going to go there. Rusty said turn it to cash. Two, who give 3000 2000 maybe now $3,000. $2,000. I take 2500 21 2000 dollars would be now 2100 dollars 100 21 2100 100 now 21 would ya I'm at 2000 dollars would be now one give me one one give me 2100 2000 dollars but now 2100 All right shall we talk about some of the details Okay so the hunting grounds stretch over 90,000 acres that's in Namibia South Africa this is for two people 7 days it includes the hunt it includes your laundry it includes the trophy fee or the preparation of the trophies. I mean, it's everything. All you gotta do is get yourself there and you'll have a once in a lifetime experience. And you might come home with something like <laughs> this or our friend, the honey badger over here. Truly priceless and amazing trip. We have 2,000 bid. Yep. We have 2,000, 21. 2,000, maybe now 2,100, anybody? 
Two thousand dollar baby now, twenty one, twenty one hundred dollar, one hundred dollar, two thousand, twenty one, twenty one, two thousand baby now, twenty one hundred, twenty one hundred. You have two minutes to get in your bid, guys. All right, two, two minutes bid. till seven twenty nine. You can get your bids in on that until seven twenty nine. Our last live auction, and it is a good one. Father Sagers Indian dinner. Wow, a rare treat. It's for five people, and you will experience a spicy Indian dinner. But don't worry, if you don't like spice, he will mellow, mellow it out for uh, the American palate. That's right. All right, Father Sagers dinner. Now we got 12 and a half bid. 1300. 1200 and Hannah 13, 13, 13, 13, 1200 and Hannah 13, now 13, 13, 1300, 1250, 13, 13, 13, 1300, baby now 13, anybody? 1200 and Hannah 13, 13, 1300 dollars, 1200 and a half. It's a three course meal with three special dishes, and the date and location will be arranged with Father Sager. So Wonderful. you won't want to miss this dinner. All right. Mm -hmm. 1300, anybody? 1300. Twelve hundred and a half, thirteen, thirteen, thirteen hundred dollar down, thirteen, baby now, thirteen hundred dollar. Twelve hundred and a half, thirteen, 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 anybody, thirteen hundred dollars, y'all done. Thirteen hundred, thirteen hundred. You have two minutes to get your bid in. That item will close at seven thirty. So seven thirty okay. on the dinner with Father Sock. Seven thirty it is. Thank you very much. Well, we thank want to you, thank Rod. you, Rod. It's never green without well. you. So <laughs> okay. we appreciate your thank, services. Thank you very thank much. Thank you. All right. Oh, we've got some applause from the studio audience. Did you know we're going to have a studio I audience? I did not. I was pretty surprised. Awesome. All right. We do want to remind all of our auction bidders tonight, live items and silent, you will be notified through the green mobile site of your purchases. So all those text net notifications that you're getting on your auction items, that's how you'll know your final bill, what items you won, what you didn't. And then auction items can be picked up at the endowment office Tuesday through Friday next week. I am checking in with our viewers. Okay. I think they're still with us. So I hope so. Be sure and let us know uh, what you are watching, where you are watching, and drop us a note in the comments. If it is also appropriate, send us a picture That's from right. wherever you may be going green tonight. All right. Also, a reminder, the silent auction, it's still open. Bids okay. until 8 o'clock. So you've still got, what, about 30 minutes to be getting your bids in on the silent auction. So check for updates, keep bidding, and let's remember what we're doing tonight. It's for the kids. It is for the kids. And speaking of the kids, I'm the parent of a graduate. And plus, right. I have an eighth grader. And mm -hmm. Wendy is the parent of three students. We're blessed. We have great facilities, great coaches, and absolutely the best teachers. Absolutely. I could not agree more. But it really, being here in the library, it makes me wonder, thinking about school days, right. do you think you could have survived Mrs. O's class, Joe? Mrs. O, Mrs. O. Oh, oh, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. He's yes. bothering me. Oh my goodness, did you wake up naughty today? Joe, you, you have refused to work with me. I've given you the option to work with Deacon Irish or myself. You have absolutely refused to work with me. So this is my option now. Deacon Irish, can you hear me? Deacon Irish, I need your help. Oh, if only I had a phone in my classroom, if we had security cameras in the hallway, that would save us so much time and trouble because kids sometimes are naughty, much like Joe today. Uh, if we had a, a water fountain to where I could just push a button and have, oh my goodness, I need coffee. Oh, I need water for my coffee. Can anyone help me? I think it's safe to say you could no, not have survived no. Mrs. O's class. I think that is safe to say. I think I would have, though. I think she likes me. Uh, yes. On a serious note, however, Mrs. O makes a very good point. We do have some pressing safety and security needs at our school, and we need your help to address them. These are our green fund-a-need projects for 2020. If we can reach a goal of 15,000, we can have new touchless drinking fountains that allow our students to follow all COVID guidelines and get water safely. These are needed in all of our school buildings. Now, if we can make that title rise to 30,000, we could purchase a security camera system for our campus. 
Not only will this protect our facilities, it's also an important tool to keep our students and our staff safe. And this is something that we do not currently have in any of our school buildings. And let's not stop there. If we can reach a goal of 45,000, we can also install a new phone system at St. Pat's, or St. Pat's teachers, uh, you saw them, they use a megaphone to uh, get a hold of anyone. They don't have phones in their classroom. This is a security concern and your generosity will help solve this problem. That's right, it's easy to donate. We're asking you to join us tonight. Once again, on your phones, in the main menu, click on Donate Now. We hope you'll consider those options that are at the top of the list, but I assure you every gift, no matter what the amount, is gonna make a huge difference for our schools and for our students. So uh, let's do this, let's do this, Green supporters. We did it last year. Help us make it happen again. Uh, let's get going. Let's check our donation total and see if we can meet our goal. We want to thank you to everyone who is helping us out with these important projects tonight. And we want to give you a shout out on air. If you can make a donation with us tonight, click that Donate Now button. We want to give you some love on our live virtual green right now. So the first people we get to thank Andrew and Madonna Jett. Absolutely, it's good to uh, have them in there. I know that uh, during the live, when we're normally in person, you've right. got that going up on the board and it, it's instantaneous. Right. I don't know if it's quite instantaneous. I'm not sure on, that it on, is. On, I know we've got, computer, I but, know uh, we've got Nelson more donors. Jett. Thank you, Nelson Jett, the Jett family, super supportive. Ladd and Kristen Lake, thank you very much. Absolutely, a approaching, uh, is, that, is that moving? 44.95, we're, climb, we're climbing up a little bit. Be sure and r remind them how to uh, donate right yep, now. Yep, that's right, to... on your phone, donate now. Thank you, Brad and Jessica Braithwaite for your contribution. And also Chris and Michelle Pasquinelli. Yep, great to see them great. in here and we thank them. Michael and Allison Knopfsinger, thank you for your gift. We are up to close to 7,000. We need to keep going. You know this lady. I do know this lady. That's my mom. <laughs> Thank you, Vona and Kim Cook. Also, Crystal and Matt Welch have donated. We right. appreciate the donation. Thank you, Welches. I also saw Kobe and Maddie Krebs sneak in there before it changed. Thank you to Kobe and Maddie. Up over uh, 7,100 right now. Stephanie Wieson, Wieson is in yep. and also Beth and Mike Naziska, thank you very much. Uh, Michael and Sherry Giebler are in. Yes, we thank appreciate you. that. Thank you to the Gieblers. Thank you, and whoever you are, anonymous. Thank you, and also many thanks to Jeremy and Amanda Hankla for their gift. And we're creeping up on. Well, we are. So we've got at least one water fountain purchased. Yeah. No, actually, we've we're got two. two. Uh, we almost have three. Jennifer and Josh Kramer. Oh, and the voice of the Irish and his boss. That's right. I've just Struckmans. donated. Thank you. I know. I think the Struckmans are celebrating green tonight with with a lot of our friends, yes, the Torreses, yes, and I think absolutely. they're having a good time. Stephen Trisha Scholes, thank you so much for your gift. Jody Ritaka. Now speaking we know of that name. speaking of TV. <laughs> She's watching from, the last I heard she was in Minnesota. Minnesota, I think, right? yeah, yeah, thank so you. We've got viewers all around the country. For Manskis, thank you so much. Karen and Troy Tickle, we appreciate it. We are up over 14 grand right now. Uh, Shelby and Cameron Colling, thank you for your gift. Kevin O'Connor, the coach, we appreciate you being with us and your donation. It's fun to watch these. Names. It is. Some of these are, you know, blast from the past. Kevin is an alumni. I know we've got... A lot of alumni watching with us here tonight from all over the place. Yeah, you can't say the O'Connor name and not think St. Pat's. Right. Oh, they, here's a donation from Gwen and Travis Covey. Thank you so much. Yeah, we'll just say thank you. They're, they're actually yeah, they're right the, here yeah. in our studio audience. So <laughs> we just thank them in person. <laughs> Up over 15 grand. We're doing great. I know. We're cruising. We're cruising. We've met goal number one. So goal number one, let me read that. If we can reach a goal of 15, we can have new touchless drinking fountains that allow the students to follow all COVID guidelines and get water safely needed in the school yep. buildings. Yeah, so those are pretty we've cool. We've been yeah. able to put one uh, in the St. Pat's High School building so far as a part of our campaign project. We want them in all the buildings. Look who's in, yep. Lisa and Marty Trashinsky. Uh, uh, thank uh, you, Trashinsky. Yeah, yeah, I mean, uh, he did what? Uh, oh, I know her. 
You do know yeah. her. Yeah, Candy Spady is in. Okay. We appreciate that. Uh, Marty was the MC of this, what, the first 10 he was years, for, right? He, yeah. He really wants you to know that you have to get to 10 years before I just saw you my name on, on it. You were looking right. at me, yeah. Thanks, Joe. I'm in. Hey, Ann and Dave Peeper, thank you very much. And Anonymous, we always appreciate. Absolutely. Oh my gosh, this is so fun. Whose yeah. name is going to pop up next? Who's next? As you're looking at the names, I'm going to remind everybody, if we can get to 30000 we could purchase a security camera system for the campus. Not only will this protect the facilities, it's also an important tool to keep the students and staff safe, and it's something that is not currently in the building. So. Yep. What names Absolutely. did I miss Very while I was important. looking at that? Ah, you missed Eric Paterka, Rick and Vicki Carpenter. Thank you so much. Jerry and Diana Phelps were on there while you were visiting. I see Bart and Kim Schroll on there. We appreciate yes. that. Yes. Oh, Natalie Cox, our kindergarten teacher. Thank you so much. Trevor. We love Trevor. Everybody Tre knows Trevor. Yeah, everybody knows Trevor. Great to have him watching. Huge uh, Irish fan, huge Bulldog fan, Absolutely. huge sports fan. We love Trevor. Absolutely. All right, where are you at? We know you want to see your name on this screen. Let's keep those donations rolling. Up to almost 23. Ah, a recent alumni, yeah. Kateri Knopfsinger, thank you. Joe and Kasha, thank you. Krista Hess, we appreciate it. Thank you for being in with us. Over 24 grand yeah, cruising this is towards amazing, you guys. 30. Todd Winder, thank you so much. While we're watching these, we also want to note, uh, we are going to leave this donation appeal. Donations are going to remain open through next week. So even if you don't have time, if you're not able to get on here tonight and donate, if you want to encourage your friends and family to donate, they can do that through next week too. I saw the O'Neills were on there. I know that they're hosting a party. The Kleins were on there. That's right. Phil and Kelsey Hyman, a school family. Thank you so much for your gift. Rusty Kip. All right. Offered the au auction item. Their family did. I we saw the that. Grangers on there. I saw Jana Greenwood. I Cheryl saw Nutter. Cheryl Nutter. Perfect. Melissa Mosel, thank you for your gift. There's Dan and Judy O'Neill. Yeah. So we had, thank uh, you, Dan and Sean Judy. Sean and Kelsey, and there's Dan and Judy. I think uh, I think Dan and Judy might be hosting as well. I think they might. I think that's I where saw Gretchen is, yeah. Montgomery's on there. Thank you very much, Mike and Laura Montgomery. Thank you, Cindy Tierney, for your gift. Joe, I've seen a lot of teachers' names come uh, across here. That is pretty cool to and, see. And impressive, That's right? That's pretty and, amazing. And shows you what they think of their school. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you to the Rolfs family. Thank you to the Bryant family. Thank you to alumni Michelle Hoffman for your gift. Oh, we're almost at 30,000. We're almost and at 30,000. Who's going to help us get there? Not not only uh, are the teachers impressive, but you you the, you see these names and you're like, you know, basically oh, yeah. you know every name. School parents, our St. Pat's Church family, Deacon Mark and Mary Lister, thank you for your gift tonight. Oh, almost there. I think we're going to get there. I almost feel like we need another drum roll. Oh, he's standing by. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Who's going to get us to 30,000? I know keep, we can do it. We're going to keep the drum going until we get over 30,000. <laughs> so if you don't like hearing the drum, <laughs> donate. <laughs> you can donate and that'll shut up the drum. Oh, Mariah Eikhoff, thank you for your gift. No, we're not there. Keep going, drum. <laughs> oh, we're oh so close. We're oh so close. Green family, are you out there? Help us out. A reminder, this is for the security camera system for the entire campus, much needed. It's not anything that we have in any of the buildings right now. It'll be cool to have. We are within $505. Oh. Kelsey Brown is helping us. The drums are even louder in person than you think. Some, somebody's gonna. <laughs> put in 505 just to say. I hope so. I'm tired of the drum. Oh, Tony Slattery Slatteries. family, thank yes. you. Yes, we appreciate the Slatteries. I mean, we could do this all night, couldn't we? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> I haven't been watching. Are we gaining viewers, losing <laughs> viewers? I don't know. Oh, close. Cami Simonson, thank you so much for your gift. 
Next one's gonna do it. It's gonna do it. I know it's gonna do it. Who's gonna put us over 30? Anonymous? Oh. Close. Oh! Oh, Anonymous. we're there. Thank Anonymous, you. thank you very much. All right. Oh, Irish is Matt and Melissa. 30. Thank you so much. We appreciate uh, the Irishes. We are over 30. Are we gonna keep going for a little bit here? Because I do wanna say that, okay, I think so, so we're over 30. So we are. the goal was 45. 45. And so we've got the, the fountains, right? We do. We've got the security cameras. We and do. if we can reach 45, that is so that Mrs. O doesn't have to use that uh, megaphone. That's right. Uh, when trying to uh, <laughs> escort me out of the class. Right. Well, and I'm not sure everybody understands what a need this is. So, and it's really a security issue. Um, our St. Pat's teachers don't have phones in their building, so if our office needs to communicate with them, um, it's really a challenge. So it it is a need, and and it's a pretty expensive one. It sounds like it almost goes hand in hand with the video. I mean, you get the video cameras, yep, I think the does. phones. You're yeah. pretty much kind of set Absolutely. up uh, security-wise, well, right? Who doesn't want their kids to be safe while they're at school? I exactly. know I do. I've, I've been looking at you. I haven't All we right. missed Brent, some names. Brent and Nikki Downey, thank you very much. And to anyone that we missed announcing, I hope you saw your name on the screen well, and know that you're appreciated and the, just as much. And the great thing about this is, uh, so we're live now, right? Right. But once it's over then people can watch it anytime, right? Absolutely. And, and these names, so everybody will see all the names that, right. that people donating. So. Right. Great entertainment. Well, I, I just kind of made that up, though. It, I mean, can we can we really watch this later? I, I think don't know. we can. Tech team, can we okay. do that? We can do that. I was thinking we could, but then I got to thinking, well, maybe I shouldn't say we that. We can do that. I, you and I may right. live online <laughs> forever and ever. <laughs> Anonymous, uh, 31 330. Uh, to get us to 31, 330, a lot of threes in All there. All right, yeah, that's awesome. How fun to see this climb. Why so don't... at 45, does, uh -huh. is that all red? Yeah, if it's we all get red. To, if yeah. we get to 45, that goes to all red? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, I don't think we break the internet, but I think it fills in all to red, yeah. <laughs> well, I don't know about you, Joe, but this has sure been a fun night. It has been, and you know, you miss being, uh, you know, with everybody, mm -hmm. but you made the call and and the endowment made the call like, hey, we need, we need to do what's safe. Right. And here's what's impressive to me, and like I haven't told you this, but like who would think that you could come up with all of this and even though we're not together, a lot, a lot of families and friends are together and it's still, I mean, it's maybe not as great, but it's still, what a great yeah, night. Yeah, it's right? still pretty great. I know that uh, people are we've talked to a lot of people that are gathered together with family and friends tonight so um the ones that won those uh party boxes the wagons they're oh, probably yeah. having a lot of fun i hope they are <laughs> oh the spirit wagon winners yeah i hope those spirit wagon winners yeah. are having a lot of fun safely jerry jorgensen thank you very much that's right well what do you think well uh, what do you think you're the boss <laughs> oh that's right i am the boss <laughs> well, I think it may be time. We'll, we'll wrap this part up for now. However, I do want to It'll remind stay you, open, right? our donation appeal is going to stay open. If you'd like to see that number rise for us up to 45, like we're hoping, you still have time to get those bids in and to let everybody you know know that they can still donate and get those bids in. Important projects. Thank you for your help tonight on doing those. We're super excited to be able to accomplish these things for our schools. And w when you think about it, and there's probably more money that's even gonna come in, but it's kind of amazing what we just, I mean, that's, a, that's a big chunk it of is. change that we just, we're Absolutely. sitting in the library and people are sitting at home and it almost kind of brings a tear to your eye, really, yeah. that, that that just happened. Yep. So, uh, very cool. Uh, we're on camera, but Kevin, this is uh, uh -huh. going to be your uh, part here. Before uh, we wrap up this edition of Green, we want to be sure and thank our teams working behind the scenes right. with us tonight. First and foremost, and they've done a great job. There they are Absolutely. right there. Uh, Dennis and Donovan McConnell, they are with uh, Decatur Productions. We thank them for all of the video elements and streaming technology and also to our drummer. He helped us get over 30 grand single-handedly. Kim Cook, thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> it, it wouldn't be a green without him, That's I know right. that. 
I also want to give a special thank you to our Green Committee. They were amazing help this year along with our endowment board of directors. And I hope you get on our green site, go to the main menu. Please take a look at our sponsor and volunteer list. There are many of them and they were all amazing help and we're grateful for them. And we also, uh, as people probably heard, we do have a studio audience. Well, they're more in a studio audience. They've, they've been helping yes. us a ton. So we want to say uh, thank you to Andrew and Madonna Jett, also Nelson Jett. Gwen and Travis Covey are here. Pam and Kevin Wood are here and uh, Jojo Jensen. And we appreciate all of them. They've That's been right. amazing. And we also need to give a special thank you. We've got some friends and colleagues here with us tonight from Grand Island Central Catholic and Kearney Catholic. So a lot of Catholic school support in our house tonight. And last but certainly not least, uh, it's time to uh, hear from our fearless leader. Uh, That's right. He, he didn't want to come over. He doesn't want to come on camera. You probably know, Kevin, he's a little bit shy. Well, is he? <laughs> but he will say a few words. Kevin. Uh, we appreciate you being here. And what'd you think okay. of the night, first of all? I think it's just a... Oh, at the mic. There you go. <laughs> at the mic. Sorry about that. I'm not quite as polished <laughs> as you two. Just an incredible response from, from uh, our families, our community, the community at large. And I just wanted an opportunity to say thank you, everyone, for supporting Catholic education in North Platte. Uh, the, the amount of work that has gone into a night like tonight... Um, I know that it probably doesn't replace uh, the live event, but the response that we have had up to this point has just been absolutely outstanding. And I guess uh, I'm humbled by that response. I'm thankful for all the support that we have. And I can honestly say, though, that I am not surprised by that because that's just the Irish way. When uh, we, we come into a a change like this, uh, it's been a difficult year for all of us, and, and we know that, and our community and our Irish fans have responded just absolutely wonderful tonight. So thank you, everyone, for all you've done. Thank you to Joe and Wendy uh, for their hard work and the Green Committee and everyone that's here tonight. So have fun out there. Uh, my phone is buzzing uh, <laughs> with uh, a lot of updates from the Green parties, and it sounds like everyone's having a great time. So enjoy your night, and thank you for supporting Catholic Education. All right. Thank you very right. much, uh, Superintendent Kevin you, Dotson. Kevin. And, and thank you for all that you do. I mean, That's right. what a great leader to have Absolutely. at this school. Now, for some uh, closing thoughts on next year. I mean, hopefully right. we're going to be in uh, person next year. And if I we are, so. we've got a little sneak peek. <laughs> Hey everybody, it's Sam from the Fun Piano Show. We're sorry we're gonna miss you at the Green Fundraiser this October due to all the stuff, but we're looking forward to being with you next October 23rd, 2021. Please mark your calendars. October 23rd, 2021, we'll be back in North Platte with the Green Fundraiser. See you then. Joe, some good news to share before we leave. Our donation total is over thirty-seven thousand. Wow. So amazing! We're absolutely we're uh, approaching that forty-five. So yep. thank you. Keep, thank you so much. Keep it going. What a fun night! It has been fun. Thank you for the all that you do. Uh, what a great idea! And hopefully you guys all had fun and continue to have fun absolutely. It, on this green night. Let's quote Green Day. Okay. Uh, you don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. From all of us at Green Headquarters, thank yeah. you. And good night. We'll see, you see you next, next year. year.